And it all belongs to you, said it all belongs to you When Jesus says, nobody can say no What's going on YouTube? I'm back with another video When Jesus says, nobody can say no Y'all, I'm going to get this review on Michelle Williams album Journey to Freedom Yes! Oh guys, don't y'all feel the gospel spirit right now? Guys, okay I love me some gospel But there's a certain type of gospel that I like Nowadays, the way that they're making gospel is kind of turn up-ish And that's the type of gospel that I like to listen to Even though it sounds ruggish and turn up-ish I like it because it's, it's speaking about the Lord Christ himself. So, guys, I am a lover of the Lord, despite of what people think about me, despite of how I am in my videos, sometimes how I portray myself. I'm not perfect. We all are not perfect. But, guys, I got to put, put a little gospel in there somewhere because if you pray as much as I pray and you've been, been through some things like I have, then you will understand. So, we're going to get into this album review of gospel gangster herself, Michelle Williams of Destiny's Child. Yes, won't he do it? Won't he do it? Won't he do it? Let's get to this review. Need your help. That that was a turn up song for for for, for the Lord. That was a turn up sword. A turn turn up song for God. Yeah, I, I I I love it. I love it. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. The beats on this album is epic, and even though they sound like some of them sound like R and B songs, and some of them sound like you know uh, songs that uh, regular singers like Beyonce or somebody or Kelly Rowland are singing to, they are talking about. Uh, 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 just, 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 just divinity and devotion and just all things Christ, all things godly. So, guys, this is what I love about this album. You know, they are, they, the, the songs are real nice and it sounds like now. It doesn't sound traditional. It's got a little, it's got, it's gospel with a twist. And I love gospel with a twist to it. So, need your help. I was definitely feeling like, Lord, we need your help when I was hearing that. I'm like, yes, Michelle, I feel you. Her voice was slaying on this album as well. OMG. If you heard songs like If We Had Your Eyes, ooh! Y'all remember I did the review for that last year, but it's about doggone time this girl got this album review. So let me just let me just say she was really singing on this album. The next song, which is Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Wah, 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 wah. Guys, that was kind of like a pop-like type song. I was definitely feeling, 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 feeling. Her vocals on that song was 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 very you know out there. You know, it was very outspoken of her. Cause she's a Leo. Shout out to her. I'm the y'all. This is the Leos running. Even though it's Virgo season, Leo still running. So shout out to 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 my girl Michelle for being a Leo. All right. So she she snapped on that song. It was very outspoken for the Lord. I love that. I love that. Everything. Lord, you are everything. He is everything. He is every, He's the air you breathe. He is everything. I was definitely feeling that song on the album. That was not like another turn up song. Okay, Fall, featuring one of the epicest, most illest gangster rap persona Christian rapper, Lecrae. Who also, I have an album review for you guys coming up. Okay. So, I was definitely feeling Fall featuring Lecrae. I was definitely feeling Lecrae is an amazing rapper, Christian rapper. Guys, I was definitely feeling his album is epic too. OMG. The fact that he did all that without cursing, y'all. But anyway, 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 anyway. I'm not going to get into that right now. I'm going to get back to her album, Fire. I've been feeling fire since day one. Now, some people have been kind of trying to bash Michelle with fire and say yes. I'm going to have to get their life just a moment. But I was definitely feeling fire, guys. That's one of my favorite songs on the album. That was kind of like another little turn up song. I love the beat on the song. Yeah, uh, 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 uh. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Free. Something about that song, the way that that girl was singing on that song, breathes my spirit. 
I definitely love every moment of that girl singing that song. That song is just epic, okay? Her voice just stood out when she do her high notes. OMG on that song. I lose it. I lose it. Especially at the end, she did a little... I said, girl, you better come ahead and give me Michael Jackson. But she 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 had her own twist with 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 with, with that in there. But guys, I was definitely feeling that song. Uh next we get just like you. We hey, us Christians wanna be just like the Lord, okay? We are striving to sh striving to be with the king, where the king is at. So guys, uh 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 uh, uh okay. I'm definitely are, are you feeling it? Because I'm feeling a gospel spirit right now. Why don't we do it? But then we got a beautiful, very, very nice laid back song. It sounds beautiful when you listen to it. The song, the, it's, a, it's a warm song. It warms your spirit when you listen to it, guys. I was definitely feeling it. Love that song. That's probably another one of my favorites on this album. Believe in me was 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 very very kind of a little traditional, but it was very uh, motivational. Uh, among people, you know, going through things in their lives and needing and searching for God, you know, finding God somewhere in their life. So I was definitely feeling that. Definitely was feeling that. In the morning, was kind of like a little slash rock anthem slash. Y'all, I, I don't know. I was feeling that song. I definitely was feeling that song on the album. So I would get, I would, I would say that, that that song is another fave on the album that I like. Um... If we had your eyes, y'all know what I think about that, but they got a twist to it. Fantasia appeared on the song, but she appeared in certain little parts, guys. I didn't hear all the Fantasia like I wanted to, because I know Fantasia, she snapped on there, but I wanted to hear Fantasia, you know, do a little something, you know, a little bit more with a, uh, I heard more Michelle than Fantasia. That's no shade at all. That's no shade at all. That's not, I'm not trying to, you know, you know. but no shade, but I would. I, I definitely would have liked to hear a lot more of Fantasia on that song because I heard mainly Michelle. But Fantasia did put her two cents in the song. That's no shade at all. The last song. Mm -mm. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Mm -mm. With my girls. Mm -mm. Destiny Shout. Mm -mm. I was feeling. Mm -mm. I was feeling. Do 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 do. Do, 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 do. When Jesus says yes, nobody can say no. When Jesus says yes, nobody can say no. Destiny's Child. Now, Say Yes is another one of my favorite songs. A lot of people doubt that song. I was looking at the video. And I was looking at the YouTube comments. Uh-oh, it's time for me to go off right now. They brought Illuminati to gospel. Oh, why is Beyonce on the Why is Beyonce in a gospel song? Beyonce finally gave herself to God. Beyonce this, Beyonce that. Beyonce uh, 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 worships the devil. Why is a devil worshiper on a gospel song? Y'all... Them comments, y'all, I can't curse on this. I can't curse on this video. But them comments really made me angry. Those comments really made me angry. I had to get in some people's butt toxes about that, about that, about that song. Because, for one, no, Beyonce never said that she wasn't a Christian. Just because she has an album out. That, that that's that, that's pretty much uh, objectifying sexuality and you know love w with another person. There's nothing wrong with that. We all sin. We are not perfect. And Beyonce has never said that she didn't believe in God. See, this is the thing. This is the thing that that piss, that ooh, that makes me angry about uh, that video because I love the video and 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 Kelly and Beyonce are Michelle's best friends and sisters. So, of course, if Michelle asks Beyonce and, uh, and, and, and Kelly to do a song, you, they're going to do it because they're best friends. For one, get your life. For two, uh, 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 
all this stuff about Beyonce being Illuminati is getting played out. And I'm really getting tired of people saying that it's getting played out. There are no signs of this woman ever, ever being anything. These are the people go behind these computer screens. They do stuff. They they talk about, uh, 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 oh, she worships the devil and blah, 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 blah. Have, have you ever, have you even met her in real life? You behind a computer screen talking about somebody. Get your life, okay? Get your life. That is, no, there's nothing wrong with that song. I felt. Uh, uh, everyone's spirit on that song. I felt the video. Uh, Kelly and Beyonce both did a good job. They all stood out in the song. Not just Beyonce or not just Michelle or not just Kelly. They all did good as a, as a, as a group. Uh, like, normally. So, I don't want to, I don't like hearing nobody's mouth about, oh, uh, uh, why is a devil worshiper and, and a gospel song? Oh, I really want to say something, but I can't say it right now because I'm doing this. I'm doing this. Because uh, uh, just just to clear just just to clear everything up, y'all. I I I love I love this to shout with all my heart. Those are my girls right there. Uh, you know I've been a big fan of them for a long time, and I just had to get this out my chest because it really makes me angry when people want everything Beyonce is in. Everybody always gets say, "Oh, she wants with the devil," and all blah 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 blah. Those that stuff is really getting old, and people are really starting not to believe it no more. So, um. All you people, I'm just going to just say this, kill yourselves. Okay, next, this album, if you are a Destiny Child fan, if you are a Michelle Williams fan, if you would love you some gospel, if you go gospel gangster for this album, pick up this album on iTunes, buy more than one copy. This album is a 10 out of 10. Deuces.